symmetric item potent matrix projection. ChatGPT just threw all those words at me as if I would understand them, despite being someone who hasn't taken a formal math class in 15 years, never learned linear algebra, and has been brazen enough to try to learn it only with the chat box of ChatGPT. I'm on day 15 so far, and I will say the symmetric item potent matrix projection did make sense to me after I sent some more messages and broke it down. The key is just being really inquisitive and continuing to ask ChatGPT questions to understand this stuff. I've got a lot of exciting things going on right now, so tune in if you want to see more. But one in particular is I'm going to ask ChatGPT for an hour-long uh, diet of videos that I can watch to understand this a bit better. One really lacking thing about ChatGPT and a lot of these AI language models is they, they, they don't do visuals along with the text. It's just kind of one or the other. And with linear algebra, there's a lot of visualization that I feel like I'm just not quite there on yet. So. People have mentioned, I've seen some really great comments, keep commenting, but three blue, one brown, a really amazing epic YouTuber that I'm familiar with has a whole linear algebra series. Anyways, I'm gonna go and stream an hour of watching YouTube videos to understand this better after this course. I wanna see how far I can go with just the AI chat first. Um, anyways, I have a test tomorrow, so stay tuned for that. It's gonna be exciting and interesting to see how I do with the Graham Schmidt process, all this orthogonality, orthonormalization, crazy sounding words. And uh, thank you guys for being here for the journey. Stay learning.